so hello friends welcome back to channel in our previous video we are talking about the run level so we'll run the run level command on this server okay so this is the run level previously this system was running on run level 3 and currently is running on a 5 okay so i told you there are different type of run level which start from 0 to 6 okay so i have make a list of the run levels over a notepad i think you are able to see so first run level we are having is 0 okay it is called run level 0 that is in power of state or shutdown if you shut down a server that is called power in power of or init 0 or run level 0 okay there's a power of stage init 0 if you want to shut down a server you can execute init 0 or shut down both the command second run level we are having one okay that is called single this is a single user mode okay when something is uh, like file system or some issue is saying while rebooting okay and server is not coming up we used to take a system in a single user mode where we can fix multiple things we'll learn about those things how to do that things okay that is called single user mode only from console you will be able to exit because network and other things services will not work okay then third point we are having two and four okay both the run level we are covering in a same it's a run level two okay this is multi-user target mode user define specific run level by default we are not using two two and four okay then we are having run level three which is called multi-user target cli okay this is non-graphical mode so in it three like it is showing here also as a run level 3 where it works in a CLI mode then we are having run level 5 which my system is currently working that is a GUI mode graphical mode but the difference between RHL 3 and 5 that is CLI in GUI but in a background to bring the server in a GUI mode Linux work on around 1900 more packages you it will get installed on the system so to make it lighter in the corporate world most of the servers are running on run level 3 and most of the server are installed with the run level 3 only there is no other run level installed on that if you try to run init 5 that will won't work because those packages are not available but there are some few servers which we use to work for gaming and some other thing we are customer request for a GUI thing so we used to install that also but very rarely you will find the GUI thing then we are having run level 6 this is just for reboot if you do init 6 system will get shut down and bring up okay or you can run the reboot command so that's the run level 6 so these are the all run level 0 1 2 3 4 5 6 okay 0 is for shutdown 3 is for single user mode 5 is for graphical mode 6 is for reboot 4 and 2 we are not using okay so that's all about the run level we can set the run level by default what's the run level okay so let's see what's the run level set on this server currently run level is set to 5 but earlier in article 5 and 6 there is file called in its tab but now run, has, run level has got changed from run level to system or targets so we, now we are having command system ctl system ctl list hyphen units units hyphen t target so it will show all the target now we have to go multi user target okay that's the run level 3 so what we'll do system ctl let me clear my screen so how to change the current run level like run level we are having run level 5 it is running on run level 5 for that we are having command system ctl default so it's showing default is graphical target but how I come to know what are the other targets okay so for that what we command we are having we are having a command system ctl lists hyphen unit hyphen type equal to target 
so it will show all the available target so graphical target is already set i want cli that is multi user target okay so default is this now we'll set current run level to a multi user system ctl set default okay it has got change i think get default hola okay see earlier get default was showing graphical target after running this command it has been changed to multi user target now what's the thing this thing will come after reboot okay we have to reboot the server before that run level is 5 okay and it is showing no so that means server booted itself in a run level 5 now we'll reboot the server and we'll see on which run level system is booting up i have executed session has gone let's see the virtual machine okay it's booting here okay it's came up but in a cli we'll restart the session okay we'll become a root user first let me clear my screen now i will run run level command okay it's showing n and 3 so now the default run level set it on the server is 3 whenever a system got reboot it will come up in a run level 3 that is the requirement so this is the way to change the run level default run level whenever system get rebooted it will come on that default run level okay now we are seeing a run level okay they are people used to say targets but run level is the correct thing So that's all for the today's video. We have learned what's the run level, what's the run level command is showing, how to check the current run level, how to change the default run level. Okay, that's all for today. See you in the next video. Till then, keep practicing. Bye bye.